Hey there friends, it is me and Bailey, and we are about to try the northern section of the Port Sheldon Natural Area. And when I say try, it is because of that swampiness. Uh, last time we came out here earlier in the spring, now it's July, uh, we couldn't get far at all, but let's go check it out. You can see here, this is 160th Ab, and we're going on this short loop on this side and the loop up there is where we were in our previous one and they do connect but I do not see a path through that chunk which is interesting and Bailey is saying it's time to go so let's get cracking this is an off-leash area so you do have more room to roam I'm letting Bailey go on a little stroll for a second. Lots of birds to hear. And it's a beautiful July day. Here comes my girl. Good job, Bailey. We are using the GoPro again. It's nice to have variety, I guess, in the videos. And I didn't mind last time. The audio wasn't that bad. And this time, being as far out in the sticks as we are, we won't have half the car noise. One item of note is this goes right up against a gentleman's property over here to the right. And he has posted in several locations that we are not allowed to be there. And then over here on the left, Right now we're on a ridge, but you can tell there is a lot of moisture still down there. Right there you can see the property. There are horses there, and the last time we were out here, Bailey stopped and stared at the horses forever. This is where our trail ended last time. We got to this part and it was so moist that we were not able to continue. <laughs> and Bailey's checking out the horse area again. Come on, big girl, we're going this way. Good girl. She just stopped at this little ridge. We did try and go up that way last time, but we ran out of space there as well. All right, so as you can see, it's dried out a little bit. It's still pretty muddy, but hey, we're gonna give it a go today. Uh, there is a little bridge made here, and we're gonna try and go over it. How do you tell a dog stay on the bridge? No, we don't want to go up there, Bailey. Woo, the mosquitoes are thick too. All right. So, we made it through that. And let's see how far we can go. This way, big girl. Going around these things is not helping me. All right, we've got a path, friends. Woo! I don't know what that's gonna look like on video, but at least you can see we made it to somewhere new. It's like a little bayou. All right, you guys are never gonna be able to accuse me of being a quitter. Uh, we are gonna try and make it all the way across here. Bailey has got the advantage of being way lighter than me. <laughs> so 
so she makes it quite easily. Where I am always trying to balance on sticks. But we are through and back on the paths. Maybe on the way back we'll try that side over there. And this looks more appealing. Right, Bailey Boo? Yes, good girl. You're doing good, big girl. It is beautiful enough back here, you almost forget all the nasty stuff you went through to get here. One thing to note is that there is absolutely no signs throughout this park. And we just made it to another wet area, but we are on the correct side of it. It's cool over here, it's nice and dry. And over there, it's like a swamp. <whistles> Bailey's in off leash mode at the moment. And as you can see, she came back to me when I whistled but she is definitely enjoying a little bit of freedom. And with the amount of work it took to get out here, I'm pretty sure she and I are gonna be the only dogs in this park today. Right, big girl? Where's my puppy? Good girl. Do you like this park? Is this good? Oh, yes. I can officially say that I'm glad that we made this trip instead of checking it out back there when it was bad because this is really pretty. You can see there, uh, unmarked, but there are some trail options. I don't know if Bailey and I will explore them all today. At least you know there is a little bit of variety in the trip. Good girl, thank you for coming back. Yes, good dog. Here's another location where the trail splits. We're gonna stay left. That's gonna be our plan today. Trees cover this area up quite a bit. It's nice and shady. It's only about 10 a.m., so uh, it's not too hot yet, even though it is getting near the middle of July. Here we come upon the water again. Of course, Bailey being a lab. I've got to tell her I don't want her in the water. But this is actually the, this is actually the clearest the water has looked. Good girl. You can see as muddy or as black as that mud that we walked on looked. Uh, the puppy paws are still really clean and I am pleased to say that my shoes are not filthy either. With the lack of signs on this trip, I have got no idea how to know when we've got back to the uh, far edge of it. But hopefully I'll be able to show you something that lets you know when you hit the edge. Maybe it'll be a sign that says no trespassing. Mm -hmm. 
this path seems a little bit more uh, used. Uh, it's wider. Could also just be uh, the way the trees are and the pine needles uh, limit the plant growth. But this is a pleasant path and reminds me a lot of Riley Trail. Right. Bailey wants the path to the left. And I'm going to be flexible today because we're exploring. There is a road up here. So I'm going to grab the leash just in case we actually pop out on the road. Come on, big girl. Good girl. It's getting lower again. You can see there's water over there. So far, this path is much drier than where we started. So it's possible we may be able to find another entrance to this place. isn't as bad as where we were earlier. I feel like we've turned back to the west too because the sun is now on my back. So as much as I thought we were getting close to that road, we might be just running parallel to it. Because it should be right out there when we get to it. Looks like somebody had their big bike back here. I bet you this would be fun with one of those fat tire bikes. And, check it out. A teepee. What do you think, Bailey? Now you can hear the cars are right over there. But we obviously don't make it out to the road. But we are close. left and we can go right. I want to go right. really want to see if I can get out to the little road. And here we are popping out at the road as promised. see you're really close to the road this obviously is a place that you can park alrighty friends so this is a great alternative parking spot um, but you should not walk your dog down that road the cars move way too fast it's not a good idea so we are gonna head back down this path and actually use the open space all the way back ready Bailey Alrighty friends, I am not going to record the entire walk back, Bailey and I will just enjoy it without the camera on us, but if you enjoyed the video, please hit that like button. If you've got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit the notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech, and Bailey. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.